That is correct. <laughs> Yo! What is up, guys? My name is Shannon, aka Cosmic Bank. So, welcome back to MV. <laughs> I am back with my husband. Matthew V. Haynes, aka the Clockmaster. And today we're here for Happy. Nope. <laughs> Billy Madison. There it is. I kept confusing this movie with Happy Gilmore. Yeah. For like two days now. Yeah, every time we went to say <laughs> Billy Madison, it was just Happy Gilmore. Happy Gilmore, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're watching Billy Madison. And small disclaimer. We're switching the roles this time. Yeah. The past few is ones that I haven't seen and Matthew has. I have seen this movie. Matthew has not. I have not seen this movie. Yeah. yeah I don't know anything about it. I don't think I, I don't know if I've seen anything. I've just seen a picture of him like sitting down on a small desk with a hat. Mm -hmm. I don't know what that is. I, I, I have no context for this movie, guys. Yeah. I haven't seen any clips, really. I, I, I don't know anything. I don't know what this is about. I don't even know. All I know is Adam Sandler's in it. I don't know who he's playing, what he's playing. I don't know what's going on in this movie. So uh, completely blind for me. Yeah, I have no idea. So I have no idea. Yeah. And meanwhile, I've watched this movie like a lot growing up. There's a lot of stuff I've missed because I have not seen this in like years. So... I'm sure there's a lot that I just don't remember about it, but I remember the general of it. So, but yeah, I'm excited because I really love this movie. All right, let's see what it is then. Yeah. Uh, if you guys like what you see, make sure to head on over to Patreon for the full reaction. Link will be in the description below for that. And we're doing a whole lot of movies over here. We just did Kingsman, How to Train Your Dragon, Kung Fu Panda, all that stuff's over there. So go check that out. Thoughts. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and make sure you guys like, subscribe if you want to see more. And yeah. Yeah. Let's get right into it. Oh, also, before we get into this reaction, guys, please, you guys voted for this. It was highly voted on the polls at the time, like before this recording. So if you guys just make sure to check that community tab if you're not involved. I post fun polls on there pretty much every day. Pretty much. Uh, yeah. And this time you guys actually voted on this movie. So this one is for you guys. You guys voted. I better see half of y'all that voted on that movie. Watch <laughs> this video. OK. Anyways, yeah. Lotion good. It's the sneakers in the pool for me. Why are you talking Bye. like that? Is he like a child? Like, is he like... He's an adult. No, I mean, but like, is he like... Just watch the movie. <laughs> I can't answer that question. Yeah. It's a very important day. Listen, that was me when it was Wednesday. It was new comic book day. I thought you were going to say it was Nudie Magazine. No, nope, I was about to be nope, like, um. Nope. New comic books every Wednesday. Shout out my friend Dylan. We used to meet at a comic book store on Wednesdays in the early days of our friendship. Nudie Magazine Day. Nudie Magazine Day. Nudie. Dang. What on earth is happening? Does he work there? Does he live there? Madison, okay, so that's got to be his place. Mm -hmm. Either he works, either he's somebody's kid or he owns the place or something. I don't know. Madison. Hmm. Is that, does he work there? No, I'll find out. What's your taste, brother? <laughs> <laughs> Drunk chicks? Models over the age of 18. I have to make, make that, that very clear. clear. Today, there are no penguin. Oh. What it's on earth is going on? He's drunk. Oh, he's drunk. Okay. Yeah. Is he just like uneducated? Like, did they not put him in school or something? I'm not answering that question. I know you're not answering. I'm just asking. <laughs> trying to figure out, like, did they just not give him an education because he's rich? Don't ask questions. Just consume product and then get excited for next products. Right this way, gentlemen. Mr. Madison is expecting you. Shall we? <laughs> Look at him like, uh, okay. Yeah, me boy. This is a very important dinner. <laughs> you best be there. No, yeah, I yeah, me boy. <laughs> so work all right. <laughs> He's a fine piece of ass, though, too. <laughs> <laughs> Madam. <laughs> Well, maybe hey, if you look. told me there were delicious Triscuit crackers, I could have enjoyed them with you. 
Yo, I know I him. Think... Yeah. That's a dude from Get Out. Oh, really, fool? Really? <laughs> <laughs> Stop looking at me, Swan. Is he still? Yeah, he's, I think he's still drunk. Of course, he's still drunk. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> That's enough, Billy. Because you took your own sweet. I feel like that needs to be a meme. Why oh, do you invite oh, him at the table? Oh, right. Oh, oh, if you know oh, he's oh, not oh, even really. Billy. He's drunk eat your right now. Yeah, so this, is, this is like an important. Yeah, this is an meeting. important business meeting. Why would you invite him? <laughs> That's it, Billy. Get the hell out of here. <clears throat> Instigator. Yeah. How is he not seeing it though? He's sitting like right, right. there. It's, it's, right right it's, it's right here. It's right here. It's right here. It's right there. For Jack Nicholson. Jack Nicholson <laughs> now or 1974? Serving important four. question. Very important question. Meg Ryan. <laughs> Tell operator speaking gibberish. Bro, he, okay, he's clearly the op of the movie, bro. <laughs> he's clearly the op of the movie. I already know where this going. He's going to try to set Billy up to fail. Yeah, I mean, he makes a good him. point, though. I mean, he is. He is definitely making a point, but still, though. Yeah. Damn kids for this. You're all going to die. <laughs> Yo, he's in like that 70s, like, <laughs> killer, dude. Right. Yeah, Billy does behave like a child. Mm-hmm. He doesn't have the, he doesn't have the emotional maturity. Yeah. You remember that spelling B you won in the first grade? Hmm? Oh, no, you didn't. So you never really got an education. That's R what it is. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so you never got even a base level education. Yeah. Ouch. And then I get to take over Madison Hotels. Hmm. Huh. That's some idea. I would let him do it just to see if he could do it. Yeah. Hotels and it's 61,000 employees. It's too important to gamble on a game like this? No. <laughs> on Monday. Oh. Give me hell no. <laughs> Yo, just let Carl help me out, bro. Carl seems like a cool dude. Right. Carl cool, bro. Mm -hmm. I would trust Carl to be my right hand man in this yep. business. You see, Carl is smart. Carl is thinking, you know what? Look, if I get in good with the sun, I'm a I'm a I'ma be good. Yeah, I'm always gonna have a job. I'm always gonna have a job. Yeah. <laughs> Why can't you just give me a snack pack? I don't have a snack pack. <laughs> Yeah, what are you talking about? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> yeah, you better get your beautiful bugs up that driveway. What a weirdo. <laughs> <laughs> Can we look into Juanita, please? Right. I think she's just harassing them. I don't know. Back to school to prove to dad that I'm not a fool. I got my <laughs> lunch packed up. Is this even legal? You can't even do this, technically. You can do anything when you're rich. But to go to school with, like, kids as a grown man? Don't question it. <laughs> Just don't question it. All right, I won't question it, but still. Very complicated things here. <laughs> Fall in love with your... First grade. Your first grade teacher. consenting adult child. Yeah. This was no ordinary puppy. This puppy was the happiest. The way she's saying, the way she's saying puppy is making me uncomfortable. Puppy. Is that the little boy gave up looking for happy after an hour? Right. He didn't put posters <laughs> up or anything. He just sat on the porch like a goon and waited. That little boy's got to think, you got a pet. <laughs> yes. Literally. Yes. You don't look for an hour and then call it quits. You get your Literally. ass out there and you find that fucking dog. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Lucky the kids are sleeping. Now I'm really mad. Doyle rule. Oh, Doyle, you about to get all right. <laughs> about to get rocked. <laughs> what? Like every eclectic uh, teacher. Now. Bro, kid, these kids don't realize how good school was back in this day, bro. Honestly. You get to eat, play dodgeball, make crafts. Right. Listen to story time and sleep basically like a cat. Yeah, all of this just leading up to disappointment. Daddy's in prison and he won't be home for a long time. My dear Lord. So you were saying. So you are saying. Um. <laughs> 
Yo, you messed up my man Riz, bro. Right. Thank you very much, Miss Lippy. <laughs> messing up my dude Riz, bro. <laughs> or hear me out, increasing it. Tell him I'm out to lunch. Oh God, here's the villain Doing music. This? Right. Bro, the janitors used to kind of be like that, though. Is he just in the bathroom I hiding? I know, I know, but they used to kind of be like that, though. No milk will ever be our milk. Ooh, that wasn't very nice. Hey, yo! <laughs> Candy! Yo! Rolex! <laughs> I go to this party. Right, 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 right. <laughs> just get a free Rolex. Get up! Get up! Get up! You're you're humiliating yourself. Right. <laughs> that, kid is kid. that is very oh terrifying. God. And now we have just two students left. Now wait till they get to high school where they're gonna rock Beth. him. Right. She correct. <laughs> He's thinking it personal. <laughs> right. I would too. Oh. No, I'm sorry. English that's sucks, not right. bro. It really <laughs> does it doesn't make any sense. Well, English really, sucks. Are you going to the mall later? That's what I'm asking. No, I... <laughs> Correct. I am the smartest man alive! <laughs> 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 that was the most child thing I've ever yes. seen. <laughs> Playing a long game, bro. Could be worse. Mm -hmm. It could be worse, exactly. Yeah. It really could be worse. Carl playing the long game. I want to play a game. Relax, dude. Jackpot. Good morning, class. <laughs> and now we got an issue. Yeah, now we got an issue. I'm either failing to stay back or um passing. Yeah. Billy is a nuisance. He will be gone in two weeks. I apologize for this inconvenience. Jeez, what? She ain't playing games. Kid is trying. Yeah. Today, Junior! <laughs> Can't help it. He has a stutter. Yep. Kid for trying to read. Right. Yeah. Oh, Marana, come on. So hot. Want to touch the hiney? Bro, you have to pass. Right. You want me to take my shirt off for you? No, oh, thank you. Okay, baby. But remember, the offer is on the table. Yo. <laughs> oh, Juanita is something else. It's called Riz. <laughs> Rizudo. <laughs> no, Z is hard, bro. Z is, is difficult. I can never remember how to do Z. <laughs> Facts. Literally. I'm never coming back to school. Never! That's how third grade. I mean, yeah. Third grade was rough. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, what's up with these old Doyle kids, bro? <laughs> if I were him, I would walk my fat ass right into oncoming traffic. Who wrote that, though? But who wrote that, though? That's, That's sad. So mean. That's very mean, though. Who wrote that? That's actually very mean. <laughs> what did he say? Um, Miss Bond, do you, uh, if she said, like if she said yes, I'd be very concerned. More than a friend? More of a grown up than Billy. Oh, I'll give you a grown up. You blew it! <laughs> no, he didn't. <laughs> no. Yeah. <laughs> Ms. Vaughn is very responsible. Yeah. How well, she explains things to the child, you know? Mm hmm. Damn, bust around. That'll end your precious. You'll drip pretty damn quick, huh? <laughs> Don't disrespect the bus driver, no. man. Don't disrespect the bus driver. Yo, what's going on with bro? Bro is stressed out. Sorry about that. Damn guy drives like an animal. Huh? Yo, don't be stressing my bro out. Why don't you go back and sit down now? Okay. I double dare you. Yeah, like she, yeah. Like she didn't hear that. Come on now. You're two seats behind. Somebody's seats. 
some of these teachers have like ears have like super hearing he, teachers in general have super hearing are there any horse socks is anybody valid question me? anyways miss vaughn i am are there i didn't realize what she asked yeah. are you Riz. <laughs> somebody stole all our lunches who would steal 30 bag lunches <laughs> This man was out for revenge. He was not yeah, playing with these kids. He was out for revenge. <laughs> Damn Sasquatch. <laughs> well, Believe I her. It is. Is. I had an accident. You had an accident? What uh, happened? You! <laughs> Ernie P's pants, too. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Saving that him from him embarrassment. Some points. Huh? That earned him some points. Yep, it definitely did. Miles Davis. Oh, <laughs> that was the grossest thing I've ever heard in my life. Yes. Let's go. Get on the bus. Definitely earned. It's definitely earned him some points. Mm -hmm. Yo, this go hard. Yo, this go hard, man. <laughs> Ew. Uh, ew. Ew. Oh, All the snack packs. All the snack packs. <laughs> hey, bro. Pack. You're the cool. I love me a good snack pack. They used to go good, bro. Mm -hmm. Who will help me destroy Billy Madison? Yo. Oh my god. <laughs> bro. Just, just accept. You're it. taking it too serious. Yeah. Get this man out of here. Really, seriously. Dude, you want you want to eat the napkin while you're at it? Right. In your tent. What do you want to do? Ask how to pass fourth grade. Mm -hmm. All it took how you for guys Billy's doing? Riz, oof, was to uh, hey help the kid out. Yeah. I think Eric is up to something. Who's Eric? Oh, he works go. for my yeah. dad too. Stuff that he does. Oh yeah. How's that <laughs> laugh go again? You know. <laughs> <laughs> Every every movie that came out during this time just has the song. Daddy Daycare. Yep. Every single comedy movie. Mm -hmm. Bro, this dude ha this dude is just right. The fact that he made this whole board. Yes. <laughs> I'll come and visit you guys all the time. Yes, your girlfriend. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah. Obviously, <laughs> obviously, right? So He's got to find a different way to celebrate his graduation. Right, you have to. Oh, nah, the oh, jet ski by the, by the plushy joint. Nah, hands was getting caught today. World here. There's a terrific article about a wrestler named the, the Revolting Blob. Do you know something? Blackmail. Whole life. So you wouldn't want anything to happen that would make him think less of you, right? How did you get the job? Yeah, how did he get it though? Good God! Now, how can he fail him if he's the, he's not a principal for the high school? So what's his? All right. Yeah, what is his? What is his actual yeah. plan here? Yeah. <laughs> you say yuck. Yeah, you're not gonna have as easy of a time here. No, but that car go crazy though. What in the middle of this? Chlorophyll? Sounds a little personal. More like chlorophyll. Yeah. Not in high school. No, not in high school. <laughs> not in high school in the 90s, buddy. Not in high school, Ray. Oh, no. Doyle rules. <laughs> Yo, these old Doyle, Doyle kids. Nice meeting you. <laughs> Yo, all of them, bro. Playing parties. You yeah, how many years ago was that? Me. And that is what a prime member is. He's like, yeah, bro, you, he's like, man, you ain't roasting me. <laughs> Not to me, bro. Don't you say that. <laughs> Don't you ever say that. No, you got good here. Stay here. For the <laughs> love of God, cherish it. <laughs> <laughs> you really do. You though. really do have to cherish it. You really do. Um, what's his name? Steve Buscemi. There it is. Thank you.
Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> be nice to people, y'all. <laughs> yes, be nice to people, seriously. What? What the fuck? What? He's a clown killer? Maybe he just likes lipstick, Matthew. Maybe he just likes lipstick. I don't know, but we don't judge people. I mean, for no, their we don't lives. judge people. I just want to. But the dude has people to kill on the on the list and puts on lipstick. I'm thinking he's a even thinking he's a clown killer or something. After elementary school with a devastating news. Dad, he's lying. You made a fool out of me. This was a mistake from the beginning. Why don't you go ask my teachers? They don't believe you. The deal's off. Eric's got the company. What? Nah. Wow. Good news for me. I can't. <laughs> he really God. does have a weasel left. Yes. Nah, man. I wasn't. I wasn't going out without a fight. Yeah. Can't leave doing you do for so. yourself, but he's not going to think he earned it. Mm -hmm. All right. So how is he going to resolve this situation? Is his girlfriend just going to come and have to motivate him? You. Me, Jack, and Frank are gonna go around putting shit. You can smell the beer from his mouth through the screen. <laughs> You're losing your mind. How did she afford this house on a teacher's salary? That's what I want to know. All right, boys, not out. That's facts. Inherited house. Rich school. I mean, if Billy, you know, went there growing up. To talk to you. Mm-hmm. Bit, though. It's called, this is what a wife does. <laughs> a wife will snap you out of it. That's facts. Mm-hmm. Or no brains, no vision. They just drift through life like lumps of crap. Mm -hmm. What is she talking about? Mm -hmm. You have all those things. You're just afraid to use them. Yeah, you actually, you actually believe, he actually believed in himself for a second. Yeah. Yes, I will go back to school. What? <laughs> what <can> is this? <laughs> no man will take what my father has built unless that man is me. <laughs> We're here to help you build a dream. Get back in school. This dude today. is having a trip. Right. Are you lying or are you lying? Oh, well. <laughs> yeah, let's bully the principal. Mm -hmm. It's not always as I know now, mm -hmm. but I shall never. Oh, no, no! <laughs> hey, yo. Hey, yo. Freak messed things up. No. Billy should get another shot at high school. Yes. Hey, rules are rules. Technically, just shut up. Bro, it's still my company. Come on. Ready to hand the company over to me now? No. Then I'll see your ass in court. Good. You don't to tell me who I can pass my company to. Oh, I can. And I will. It's a deal. I know it was you. <laughs> I am confused just as him. 66. That is correct. You gotta give him motivation. <laughs> Every answer you get right, a lyric comes off. 88. That is correct. <laughs> there is any attempt by either contestant to cheat, especially with my wife, who was a dirty, dirty tramp. Damn. I am just going to snap. <laughs> When a guy yeah, says it like that, you gotta be very, very careful of him. Right. I am just gonna snap. <laughs> be very afraid of that man. He's in cahoots with the guy who the people to kill list. Right. What was this part of the well, Mac. Ah, fair enough. <laughs> hey oh yo! <laughs> Bros! Bro! I don't understand. <laughs> Cheated though. I don't understand what happened there. No. No, not the O'Doyle family. No. 
Oh no, not the. I got dark real quick. He said the whole half of the year family's going down. Not the Oi Doyle family. No. Well. <laughs> Uh, I mean, if I study, that'd be good, but yeah. Without studying, I don't retain half of this stuff. You might even miss Libby there. You're right. Especially the little boy. Society. <laughs> mm hmm. Knew where to find them. Mm hmm. Preach. Let him know. Let him use you, Bishop. Let him use you, Bishop. Live football rules. Let him use you. Hmm. <laughs> Is now dumber for having listened to it. I Damn. award you no points, and may God have mercy on your soul. Hey yo! Damn. Come <laughs> <laughs> on, businessman. Yeah. See, uh, so I'm gonna give this company to this ethics. man. Right. Hey yo! Yo! Hey yo, what the fuck? <laughs> no! oh. Hey yo! <laughs> yeah, he came out for me. Man, I'm glad I called that guy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he just wants. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, his friends are stone cold. They ain't afraid of nothing. Nah, they ain't afraid of nothing. They just sat there, sat there like, <laughs> back off. Yeah, literally. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, Billy. Valley. Billy's number one. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, get this clown away from me. Right. And give the company to Carl. Yeah, Carl deserved it. See, Carl played a long game. Mm -hmm. Bro, why is he here? Right. He pulled a gun in front of students. This guy's been behind bars. Yeah, he should be in prison. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hey, yo. Ask first. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bro, everyone need love. There's no ageism here. Okay, okay. That makes sense. That does make sense, though. That makes her. sense. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? You know what? I'm still stuck on the lady with the two, the two kids. We're gonna move past it. We, uh, this is weirder than the ending of 40 Year Old Virgin when. All right, so I finally watched this movie, Billy Madison. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, honestly, you know, there's not much to really talk about in these types of movies. I mean, it's, yeah. pretty, it's pretty cut and dry and straightforward. Yeah. You know, it's not a. Yeah. It's not a cinematic masterpiece. It's not and, a discussion point. Yeah, it's, it's not a. Um, yeah. It's not a cinematic masterpiece or anything like that. Yeah. That's not what this is for. Talk about the soundtrack, the cinematography, the depth, the emotion yeah, of the it's story. Not, it's not about all that. This movie ain't really all about no. all that, man. <laughs> um, but I mean, for what it was, you know, it had, obviously it was some, it's a comedy movie. Got some laughs in there. You know, I mean, the yeah. story, you know, I mean, if you really want to take something deep away, you can just say that how it's never too late for you to, to achieve, you know, Mm -hmm. certain things with your yeah. education you know like if you want to go back to school and learn some things or you know obviously it would be done like this so you'd literally go back to school in that way but like yeah. you know but, you know college college GED, or ged you know. or you know you know and this this class is for kids who just didn't even graduate like you know elementary school or whatnot you can still yeah. you know go and take those classes and, and yeah. pass them and whatnot but you know the, the most you can take away is that you know i mean you saw him grow as a as as a character yeah you mm -hmm. saw him grow you know you know, high school education, like I, I've never been to college, so you know, I never went to, never went to college. I, I still continue to learn and read and do things, but, um, but I never went to college, but you know, with a high school education, you can accomplish a lot of things. So yeah. I mean, it's kind of like the baseline for a lot of things. So, I mean, it's, you know, he got it and 
he learned what he needed to learn about it. And now, you know, he said he's going to go to college and try to become a teacher or something, which mm-hmm. I think, I think would fit him, you know, being an elementary school teacher. Yeah. You know, he's good with the kids. Yeah. You know, I we think. saw that. So, I mean, being an elementary yeah. school, I honestly, I think I would rather deal with elementary, elementary kids than high school, than high school kids. Yeah. Man, I can't deal with high school kids, bro. Yeah. Like I'd rather deal with the chaos of like a young child. Than- yeah. But you see, the thing is though, with kids, and you know it's because you used to work with kids. Yeah. Like, with kids, once you earn their respect, you earn their respect. Yeah. Like, it's not, like, especially if you're not being, like, a snob. Yeah. And you command authority, but you also make sure the kid feels heard and valid. You earn their it, respect, and they will respect yeah. you. But, you know, a high school kid, you could do the same thing. And then, you know, they come in angry one day. Mm-hmm. And it's a lot harder to achieve that. Yeah, and you're also dealing with a lot of like rapidly changing hormones. Yeah, you know, like one day a kid could be there, and then the next day they're, you know, I mean, like the, the, literally, I've seen this happen in like some of my classes, and like I've seen kids like get like you know they had to get kicked out of class because like one day the kid is fine, and then next week the kid is like all thirsting after the teacher yeah. in the classroom. And then the teacher has to now request that the student gets removed from the class. Yeah. I've seen that happen in my own classroom. I've like, never seen that. Bro, that is bro. I'm not going to say the same person's name, but like, I literally remember being in class, bro. And there's this one girl who was in class and she was like literally just chilling. Mm-hmm. Literally a couple months later, all of a sudden she's publicly like professing her love for the teacher. And the teacher was like, what what is going on here? Yeah. Immediately calls the principal yeah. <laughs> and gets the kid removed from class. I mean and I, I was like, okay. The most I've seen is like people having like a crush on the teacher, but not yeah. like outwardly. Oh no, 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 in, no. Like, you know, trying to, you know, get think, all in there. I think she was a little weird though. I can't to be to be fair. Mm-hmm. But the point is, even outside of that though, you still have like it's just normal mood stuff. Like, just normal yeah. mood stuff. Because, like, your hormones and your mood and all that stuff can play a role in that. You could, like you said, one day you could be good. And then the next day, like, you're you're raging and you're mad. Yeah. You know, like, I've been through that. Like, you know, being, like, a kid, like, just being in high school. I, I remember having high good days. Sucks. And it sucked, <laughs> man. Especially, I remember having, like, really good days. And then, like, I'm going through things as I'm experiencing things. Especially, like, during my puberty years. Yeah. I was, like, I didn't understand what was going on with my body. And, you know, it was I was feeling weird and like I didn't understand what was going on. I was angry certain days. I was overly happy certain days. I mean, yeah. you know, it's high school, you know, you're growing up. So and then as a teacher, you got to know how to deal with that, too. You got to learn how to deal with 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 young teens who are now learning how to become young adults as they go through, you know, high school, 17, yeah. 18, you know, in some cases, 19 you know, rare, but in some cases, 19. So you're dealing with kids who are growing up, especially middle school kids, too. It's the worst, man. Especially, I like, you get around, like, sixth grade. Gosh, I feel like middle school. Like, is that like, eighth grade? In a sense, I feel like middle school is worse than high school. It can be. Because our kids were, but the kids that, yeah. we, that we had in my grade were hell, man. Yeah, we've had, um like, when I used to work with kids, we had, like, some, like, middle school age kids, and my God. They were either really good or really bad. Yeah, man. I feel like they're Because they get in, like, their big bad phase. Like, no, nobody can touch me. No one can tell me what to I'm do. I'm in middle school now. Yeah, I'm in middle school. And then like, ninth grade humbles you. Yeah. Because then you got to deal with yeah. the seniors. You got to deal with the 12th yeah. graders. And then, you know, by the time you get to... The junior year is, like, that sweet spot. Like, between yeah. 10th grade and 11th grade, it's, like, that sweet spot. Because it's, like, you're, you're upperclassmen, but, like, you're not... Yeah, it's like I don't know. It's like people respect you, but then like the old, like the seniors, they 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 might bully you, or they might harass you, but then they might not. Yeah, you know. And then senior year, you just get a big head. Oh, bro, senior year, <laughs> senior year, it felt good to be the upperclassman for once. Yes, you know. But then I was getting, I was seeing all these ninth graders walking around like if they own the place, and I was yeah. like. He's like, what you, you, what you walk it around. You gotta earn your flowers. <laughs> you can't be out here just acting like you run this, bro. Right. Like, nah, right. and then, then that, and then you start to understand why the seniors are acting a certain way yeah. with you when it's you like, were a freshman. It's like you're you're a literal child still. Yeah, literally. Yeah, like you're bro. But high school, 
high school puts you through it, bro. Because like by the time you yeah. get to senior year, you're like, listen, I don't want nobody tell me nothing. I don't want nobody say nothing to me. I run these streets. I run these hallways. I don't need nobody. I don't need no ninth grader trying to try to talk to me crazy. Yeah. You're going to respect me. I earn my place. Yeah. I, I, earn, my, I earn my spot here in hey, 12th bro, grade. Like Billy said, <laughs> cherish your younger years as long cherish as you it. can. Definitely cherish it, man, for sure. But no, I mean, besides all that, man, like I said, ain't nothing crazy, but the fire yeah. I'm always chill, you know, play it on in the background, you know, definitely have to add it to the collection of yeah. just background movies. It's just silly. It's just silly. Yeah. You know, silly movie. Nothing serious about it. Yeah. Juanita was hilarious. She was absolutely oh hilarious. Gosh, Juanita. <laughs> the Steve Buscemi as the, <laughs> the killer, as the assassin is wild to me, bro. That's life crazy. lessons just be nice just be nice to people yeah you Don't never know mean. you never know no you never know man especially you never the, way, know. the way stuff is now you never know dude you gotta yeah. always be nice because sometimes the people never people never forget like he she's like oh yeah don't worry about it don't worry about it but deep down he had a big hate for this guy mm -hmm. and the fact that billy called him billy knew that he was he used to pick on this guy probably every day yeah you know wedgies whatever doing all this stuff oh no doyle family oh god Yo, he literally said, I have a feeling one day your family's going down. Oh, <laughs> it's not wrong. Mm. Yeah. I mean, they were being bullies, though, but still. Yeah. But I knew once they showed that banana that it was going to come up later. <laughs> yeah. And then they showed it again. Yeah. yeah. I'm like, yeah, no, that banana is going like, to yeah. mess up someone's car. Yeah. Yeah. But, anyways, yeah. yeah. yeah chill movie, man. Yeah. Not much to really say. Definitely. Yeah. Uh, you guys. Oh, oh I should have said this in the beginning. Um, but yeah, you guys voted on a poll, um, for this, for this movie. Uh, yeah. So yeah, appreciate it. And yeah. Yeah. I think it. we'll wrap it up here then. Yeah. Uh, make sure you guys go check out the full reaction list on our Patreon link will be in the description below and yeah, like subscribe if you like what you see and comment down below what other movies you might want us to watch. Yeah. And yeah, that's it for us. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.